रूहानी ने ओ बाबा तेरे रूहानी ने जब भी देखूं इन नैनों में जब भी देखूं इन नैनों में बात नहीं कह देते हैं तेरे रूहानी ने ओ बाबा तेरे रूहानी गहरे नैन तेरे ओ बाबा जो भी देखे इन में वही खो जाता अनमोल खजाने पाता इस सागर में जो डूब जाते इस सागर में जो डूब जाते पार वही हो जाते नैन तेरे रूहानी ने ओ बाबा तेरे रूहानी ने तेरे रूह Om Shanti. Today we have Brother Satish joining us from Gyan Sarovar to be with us in connecting the Murli. Over to you, Satish Pai. शांति यस ब्रदर गुड मॉर्निंग एंजल्स इन मेनी मुरलीस वे हैव लिजन दैट लव विद मुरली इज नथिंग बट लव विद मुरली था so now with that such a love we we will listen the murli and the date of the murli is 31st march 2011 and mainly in the murli baba in the starting of the murli baba was uh, how we are and what we are he was saying in such a special way that because in our life also we will see that every time we say any circumstances comes we say that oh what is my fortune what is happening to me but see in the murli baba told what is our fortune what is our fortune lines are and in the middle of the murli baba was explaining us that what to do for the world and what we must achieve to fulfill him and how we need to become an example and how to make the special seva that is seva through our mind so now just we are going to listen om shanti with your determined thought become an example of being tension free and become an image of support for everyone with the power of your mind 
jeev souls who are experiencing sorrow the blessing of happiness today the great great grandfather is seeing the lines of fortune of his children who are the few out of the multi millions and the handful of that few he is seeing the sparkle of the divine sparkling star on each one's forehead now just experience it that what baba is seeing is that he is seeing the sparkle of the divine sparkling star on each one's forehead on the forehead it must be a sparkling star he is seeing the line of love from their eyes from our eyes he is seeing the love he is seeing the line of knowledge through their mouths he is seeing the line of heart of being last in love for the heart of the comforter of hearts he is seeing the line of treasures of knowledge in their hands he is seeing on their feet the line of multi millions at every step on the head he, he is seeing the star forehead and in the eyes he is seeing the love and in the mouth he is seeing the knowledge and in the hands he is seeing the treasures and in the heart love of the heart for the heart comforter of hearts and in the feet he is seeing the line of multi million steps each child is full number wise in each of these lines no one part from you can have this fortune such elevated fortune of each one is visibly sparkling and this fortune becomes imperishable why because it is the imperishable father who gives it to you only at this confluence age do you attain this elevated fortune which continues in the future too this confluence age is the age of all attainment to the extent that each one of you accumulates your fortune so come so you continue to receive the fruit of fortune for many births only you children know the praise of this confluence speech the attainments of the confluence speech are the most elevated of the whole cycle babdada is saying how full each child is with the attainments of the confluence speech to all of you constantly experience all the attainments of the confluence age are only sometimes the father is imperishable and so the attainments are also imperishable you know in which form bab dada wishes to see all of you do you not how bab bab dada want to see today listen bab dada wants every child to be a self sovereign king to be a king and rule over the self that is over your what 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 you want to see one is physical senses and your mind intellect and some stars bab dada want to see us to be a king king of what of our physical senses and mind intellect and some stars of course you will have a right to the kingdom in the future but you should now become a king who has a right to self sovereignty all your physical senses should be under your control because you have received the treasure of all powers from the father bab dada wishes to see every child in the form of a king who has a right to self sovereignty see bab what bab dada have a wish bab dada wishes to see every child in the form of a king who has a right of self sovereignty have all of you become self sovereigns master of the self is asking you have you developed the ruling power and controlling power over your mind and intellect there isn't any 
dependency is there, you have a right. When you keep Bab Dada with you and you do not become alone, when you constantly keep the father as your companion, then neither your mind nor your nor intellect nor sun stars has a power not to be under your control. See Bab Dada explaining that how to become a ruling power and how to develop our ruling power and controlling power. So Baba is asked a question and also given the solution also. If you want to be, if you want to become, improve or develop your ruling power and controlling power in yourself. So he is telling us, what he is telling? To keep the father as your companion. When you keep the father as your companion, never, neither your mind, nor your intellect, nor your son starts has the power not to be under your control. That means they are all in your control. This is why Bab Dada always says to the Shaktis, which form of yours should always remember so that you never forget the father's company. Bab Dada is giving our way, very easy way. What is that? That what is that form? You all know. You have listened many times also. What form is that? I am a Shiv Shakti. So that means when we feel, when we use this self-respect that I am a Shiv Shakti. So with that, you can develop your controlling power and ruling power. And then you can rule your mind, intellect, and some stars. So today we need to practice that. What is, I am a Shiv Shakti. Shiv and Shakti are combined. This awareness automatically makes you a conqueror of Maya and a conqueror of matter because Bab has already told you that at present, the elements of matter are continuing to their work because Human souls have troubled the elements of nature. They are also troubling human souls. Nowadays, you are sitting, seeing that the elements are carrying out their work somewhere or other, but you are becoming conquerors of matter and making the elements Tato Pradhan. People are afraid on seeing the upheaval of the elements and are wondering what will happen tomorrow. We are also wondering what will happen tomorrow or we know what is happening. You know that the best of all will take place because it is now the confluence age, the Amrit Vela of the world cycle. What comes after Amrit Vela? Morning. Darkness finishes and there is light. You are now happy that your kingdom of the world of happiness, where matter also gives happiness, has now almost come. You have this happiness, do you not? In that kingdom, there will be no name of praise, of sorrow or peacelessness, because you are becoming the conquerors of matter at the conference each. What is the happiness that all of you have? See, our kingdom is about to come. This must we have the happiness that our kingdom is going to come. Do you have this happiness? Baba asking everybody, do you have this happiness? Those who maintain this happiness, raise your hands. Check yourself and raise your hands. Those who maintain this happiness, raise your hands. Very good. You remain happy and so. Congratulations for that. However, are you enabling this happiness of yours to reach your brothers and sisters through the rays that you have received from the Father? Because they are experiencing the sorrow and peacelessness. Bab Dada has said, 
each of you has to fix some time in your daily timetable to do this such service through the mind. See, Baba is giving the homework also. Each of you has to fix some time in your daily timetable to do such service through the mind. What kind of service? We must give happiness to our brothers and sisters. Just have you, and, and you see, the method also is saying what we need to do. Just as you have fixed a time for some things, See, we have fixed the time for to sit, listen the Murli. We fix the time for to go to the office. We fix the time to eat. We fix the time every, for every action we fix. In the same way Bab Dada is telling, just as you have fixed a time for other things, in the same way, throw the, throw the nourishment of your happiness and with the power of your mind, give them some blessings and make them happy. So we must be, give them the happy to everybody. Those who have fixed their time for doing service through the mind, raise your hands. This is the second question Bab Dada is asking. Those who have fixed their time for doing service through the mind, raise your hands. Acha. Those who haven't done this are few. So now fix a time for that because they are your brothers and sisters, are they not? Do you not feel mercy? Or is it that you don't feel mercy for them? You do, do you not? Bab Dada wants to see the two special things of the confluence age that are invaluable. What are the two special things of this confluence age? You got any thought in your mind? What are those invaluable things? One is the power of thought and the second one is time of the confluence age. Because in the one birth of the confluence age, you have created a reward for many births. So the main thing is of this confluence age is time and thought. Nowadays, Bab Dada sees that many few fewer impure thoughts, but that waste thoughts do, not, do continue to come. According to the value of this one birth, waste thoughts should now be finished because according to the importance of the confluence age, one second, gives you a right to so much invaluable time. This is why each one of you has to know the value of these two things, time and thoughts. And use time and thoughts in a worthwhile way because when we know the value, then only we use the things in a worthwhile way. So now today, Bab Dada wants to tell you, these two things are the valuable time and the thoughts. So know the value of the time and know the value of your thoughts and use them in the worthwhile way. Just as you use your physical treasures in a worthwhile way and you know that by using them in a worthwhile way, in this one birth, you will accumulate the attainment for many births. Bab Dada is giving the example also, how we are use our physical treasures the worthwhile way, in the same manner, we need to use this valuable time and thoughts in a worthwhile way. In the same way, pay attention to both these things, use them in a worthwhile way and become an image of success. If you want to become a successful in your life, if you want to get success in your daily day life, you need to do these two things. You must use your thoughts and time in a worthful, worthful way. Then only you, you will become the image of success. Today, Bab Dada is giving each child, each child one blessing. See, now feel that blessings. Bab Dada himself is giving the blessings. He is a God, he is a supreme soul. Everybody asks the blessings from Dadis, everybody asking the blessings from 
seniors, everybody asking gurus. But today, Bhavdada himself is giving the special blessings. What kind of blessings? See, can each of you children make yourself tension free from today? You felt that? Can each of you children make yourself tension free from today? Have the determined thought that from today there will be attention, no tension. I have the determined thought. What kind of determined thought we need to have? From today, there will be attention, no tension. When Bab Dada sees the children with tension, he feels, see what he feels when, when we are in tension, what Bab Dada feels, see. He feels he should immediately take their photograph and send it to them. Babdada wants to take the photograph of attention, please. And he wants to send it to us. Immediately that also. And they will then understand what they have become. He wants to show our face to ourselves. And he wants to make us understand that what we are becoming. Babdada wants to make you a conqueror of the mind and a conqueror of the world. You know what Babdada wants to the wants has to be become a conqueror of the mind and a conqueror of the world. After all, where does tension come? Where the tension come? It comes in the mind, does it not? Everything starts with the mind. So Babda is telling, it comes in the mind, does it not? So you are the kings, what we are. In the starting only Babda the told now, you are all the kings. You are masters of the self. And you are not. Is a, is a mind yours or is a mind is a master? He's asking this. Is a mind yours or is a mind the master? What do you say throughout the day? You say, my mind. What do you say? My mind. Do you not? It is not the master, is it? Who has the courage? See, Bhada explaining that. Who will get these things? Who has the courage? You will easily receive the father's blessings. What courage? What determination? That I will become tension free. This determination, this courage, if we are having, then what will happen? We will receive the father's blessings. And today's father's blessing is to become tension free. But you simply have to pay little attention. What we need to do for to become tension free? See, in our life, everybody is having the tension. Small, little, for one minute, two minutes, any time. Some got very lot time, lot of time they take for the tension free. Some will have for one minute, two minutes. So how do we become the tension free? For that Baba is explaining. But you simply have to pay little attention, only little attention we need to take. Experience the help of Father's blessing and then see. We no need to do anything because when we are having blessings, what will be happen? Everything will become very easy. No need to do any effort. Blessing is in the sense there is no effort which comes very easily. So this is the blessings we are having from the father. So Bab Dada is telling, experience the help of the father's blessings and then see. Whenever you then look at one's face, what will it be like? Tension free like a, how we will look like? Tension free like a lotus or a rose is bosom. Sorry, bloom. Bab Dada Sa, he has received news from some places of the work. He had given, you are writing down your percentage. You have the result from here too. Bab Dada is congratulating you for having paid attention. However, according to the time, 
you will not have so much time to listen and therefore according to the time now how the time is coming up this is 10 years before baba was told now also the that time only baba told this according to the time you will not have so much time to listen and therefore bab dada now wants you to do service with your mind your face and your activity now what we what kind of service we need to do we need to do the service with your mind your face and your activity the practice you have now will be useful in the times to come if you are practicing now then it is very useful the coming times can can you have the thought to remain tension free from today he once again bab dada is asking he is he want to make it sure that we want to become tension free from today can you have the thought to remain tension free from today can you do it ask yourself can you do it can you do it raise your hands tension free acha take everyone's photo very good now it is tension is increasing a lot in the world why baba want to make us tension free because now it is tension is increasing a lot in the world when the souls who have tension according to the circumstances see your experience of being tension free and that your activity and face are tension free you will become an image of support for them if the circumstances are full of free full of tension and you are becoming like the tension free then what you will become you will become the example for them so you will become an image of support for them today when you tour around in the world or hear the news what do you see they continue to invent ways to make themselves happy temporarily show those who have tension an example of being tension free because people are searching for many ways to become tension free to become happy temporarily but bab dada is telling show those who have tension an example to be tension free and they will be able to see some support because when you, when they see you they feel the support did you have the thought in your mind that you will remain tension free once again he is asking you did you have the thought in your mind that you will remain tension free did you is it a determined thought or ordinary is clearing everything is this the determined thought or just an ordinary thought because baba is asking that's why i'm i'm thinking in that way or you are surely determined having a thought that no i to from today i want to become tension free because he has given the for this solution he has given the root way also he told nothing to do become the king and one more thing he told keep the baba as your companion then the tension will not be there at all and one more thing he told it will be as a blessings from the father if you are having courage to be tension free then it will works as a blessing from the father where there is a determin determination success is guaranteed so check yourself if you want the success you need to be determined thought not that you will do it some point no no i will do it some days or some point no it's not like that but you have definitely going to do it do you like this now is asking raise your hand for this bab dada sa one thing which is that you you please by baba by raising your hands you are pleasing baba by raising your hands you pleased baba by raising your hands but what you are going to do now there is a difference of day and night between the determined thought and the ordinary thought 
see how much different is it, it is there in a determined thought and an ordinary thought. It's just like a day and the night. That you will do it. Yeah, sorry. Today is the today is the last day of this year season, but next season Babdada wants to see every center, whether small or large. You have plenty of time till then. Next year, Baba does not want any reasons or excuses, but he wants to see you as embodiment of solutions. He what Babdada wants in the next season. He want to see as all of us the centers. For the personally, we must be become the embodiment of all the solutions. How much courage and enthusiasm do you have for there not be any time, any name or trace of tension in the Brahman family? You must not have any name and trace of the tension in the Brahman family. Is this possible? Each one, each one of you can ask yourself. Is this possible? Bab Dada wants to hear this good news. See how what Bab Dada wants from us. There must not be the name and the trace of the tension in, in our life. Bab Dada saw that everyone has a desire to do this. See how he's uplifting us. Bab Dada saw that everyone has a desire to do this, but he is explaining very deeply, very easily. He, he is making us many, so giving us many solutions. If you, if you can't do this, do this. If you can't do this, do this. He is, in this paragraph, he is explaining one more small, very, very small thing. Babdada saw that everyone has a desire to do this, but when problems come, they make you belong to them. Then you say very sweet things. This happens. Does it not? This will, of course, happen. This continues all the time. Does it not? You tell Bab Dada many very sweet things. The solution to everything is simply, see the solution for everything. Listen carefully. The solution to everything is simply to become a king. That is all. Once again, Baba came on the topic of the movement, that the solution to everything is simply to become a king. That is all. If you feel any, so any problem in your life, check yourself. Whether it is in mind, whether it is your body, whether it is your circumstances, whatever the circumstances is there, Baba given one word solution. The solution to everything is simple to become a king. That is all. Become a master of the self, a self-sovereign. Baba is seeing all the children, whether you are sitting in front of Bab Dada or you are sitting far away. See, you are sitting in your rooms, in your houses, in the center. But Bab Dada, of you are sitting far away, but sitting in the heart. Where you are sitting, you are all sitting in the Bab Dada's heart. You are all in front of his eyes. Bab Dada is seeing in his heart those who are far away. So who, are, who is far away? He is in his heart. Bab Dada knows that there are small Gita Parshalas set up Madhavan today. Bab Dada is first of all giving lots and lots and lots of love affection and remembrance from his art to those who are sitting on the floor and in many different places. Because in that meeting, there are 28,000 BKs have came to meet Bab Dada. So, so many places they sat to meet Bab Dada. More than 28,000 brothers and sisters have reached Shantivan today. Screens were set up in Madhuvan and various places in Shantiwan. Bab Dada saw that some children have had a face little difficulty, but because of happiness, 
don't feel any difficulty. At least you have three feet of land to sleep comfortably. Babdada is giving special love and remembrance to those who have become Patrani, queens sleeping on the floor. Acha. Those who have come to Madhavan or to meet Babdada for the first time, stand up. Babdada is giving many, many congratulations to the children who have come for the first time to the new Brahmin family on behalf of himself and on the behalf of Brahmin family. Because even though you have come too late, you have at least come. You have not seen Bab Dada and the family. Sorry, you have now seen Bab Dada and the family. Bab Dada feels that even if you have come today, you have a special blessings that if you want it in your heart, then through you have come last, you can go fast because Bab Dada got it. given a Vardhan also, blessing also today. If you come last also, you can go fast. You can go ahead fast. Bab Dada and the family have lot for you, love for all of you souls. They, the Brahmin family, will be cooperative. They will give you love and enable you to move forward. They will give you a chance. This is why those who have come today have a very good chance in the drama to go ahead. Wherever you have come from, the whole family will be cooperative with you and you just have to become easy yogis. What we need to become? Easy yogis. Om Shanti. Acha. Can I continue or should I stop here? We can take a pause, brother. And yeah, for the two minutes, we can remember minute. Baba. Yeah. Just reflect and see what you have listened today and what you get and what you want to take from this morning. And then we will discuss on that. Shanti. What are the takeaway points you want to follow today? Om Shanti. Am I audible? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Om Shanti. Good morning, everyone. Very beautiful, Murli. Very well rendered. Uh, today, I'm sorry, my voice is gone. Down. No Today, my, my Baba has said that <coughs> seek the and my Baba has asked us to make him his come our companion, seek his blessings, pay attention, and become tension free. So this would be my takeaway point for the day. So for, that, for, for that yes. uh, what Baba for, for that Baba um, for one sentence in one word what Baba Dada told to keep his a companion. Become attention. Uh, One word. To keep his as a companion. Yeah. To keep what him is as that a... One word. But today he told that become Shiv Shakti. Okay. Okay. Shiv Shakti yeah. is nothing but keeping him as a companion. Okay. Yeah. So Thank now you. don't don't forget this one. I okay. am a Shiv Shakti. Okay. Thank you. And Uh, 
Yes, come on, next one. Om Shanti. You just Om Shanti. said it, brother, that Babas today told us to stay in the, in that in, in the presence of that word of I am the Shiv Shakti. So while the whole Murli speaks about having determined thought yes. and keep ourselves free from tension. Yes. So when I, was, when I was reflecting, when you were conducting the Murli was what is that one should bring forward? What is that I can bring forward to have attention? Yes. So the first thing which comes is add the word A before tension. Yes. Now what is that word A? That word A is I'm Atmasvarup. That A stands for the attainment from Baba. The A stands for that Alpha remembrance of that Almighty Shiva. So that's going to be my takeaway from today's Murli as adding on these things, practicing it on an ongoing basis and keep myself free from tension. Shanti Rakhi Ben, can you please uh, repeat the third A? I have got two A's for third one. Just repeat. Alpha. Alpha, alpha, alpha power. Alpha. Okay, okay. Yeah. Alpha. What does that mean, Alpha? The Sorry? supreme power. Okay. Alpha is nothing but Shiva. Okay, thank you. Come on, one more. Go ahead. Okay, Om Shanti. Uh, first of all, when Siva Ben was uh, speaking and me, she talks about my Baba. It really sounds so innocent when the innocent child says, my Baba, Mere Papa, Mere Papa kehte hai. It's, it's so beautiful. Whenever I listen, it's a my Baba. Uh, secondly, I'd like to share my takeaway. Like when Baba says, determine thought and the uh, you know, uh, the, the ordinary one. There's a difference between day and night. When I was listening yes. then, there was a, you know, thing that the determined thought is like day, when you remember it, when you're awakened. And when the when you sleep, it is like a ordinary thought. Because when you take it ordinary thought, it's like a sleeping. But Baba also tells us the technique of, uh, you know, converting the ordinary thought into the determined one that before sleeping before you know exactly immediately before sleeping you can have that you know ordinary thought and convert into the uh, determined one and the what method determined is thought you want to take visualization told you to yeah take. creative what visualization then what every determined thought, thought you want to take. Huh? yes brother yes please speak what? actually i'm on the raid i'm not able to speak uh, uh, listen okay. you yeah please you Baba. speak carry on <laughs> no, share my point yeah please Baba told to take the determined point as I want to become tension free. This determined thought Baba given today. Let us to and that the determined thought is the key to success. Yes. And this is also a blessing. Yes. Today's blessing, special blessing today. And many points are there. You are missing many, many points. Come on. Yeah, Lata, Bam, Sukram, Bhai, anybody? Om Shanti, brother. Om Shanti. Uh, Baba said that in the world, people are having uh, tension or thoughts that what will happen tomorrow. But we, Baba children, we know that what will happen tomorrow. So Baba said that you become the tension free. And uh, also Baba said that this is one world, one family. So it's our duty to make others attention free. For that, Baba said that you do service to the mind. What is that homework Baba given? He told to fix a time for that. Yeah. What fix is that? The, uh, time for, uh, Baba said that you use your time and thoughts in the worthwhile way. And uh, as you fix time for things, same way you fix time for service to the mind. What kind of service he told to give today? To give Don't raise to... on happiness. Yes. Today we need to fix the time for daily routine. As a daily routine, see, we are going for walking as a daily routine. 
we are going for the market for daily routine we are going for the office as a daily routine so to, from today we need to fix the time as a daily routine to do the service through mind of giving happiness to our brothers and sisters okay yes come on samad everyone need to speak then only we will come to know that you will understood or else you are taking as ordinary thoughts not the determined thoughts om shanti brother om shanti uh, today uh, baba told us about self sovereignty that i was finding uh, the matter for this now because i had presentation today in my school so since morning i was searching that morally i wanted the matter uh, on this self sovereignty so i found that morally also and today also baba to <laughs> today also it was in the morally i like this point self sovereignty baba wishes baba wishes us to see the king of our thoughts our mind intellect so that is great now uh, yeah. oh it's difficult but baba will help us yeah. uh, just the courage and keep bab dada with your company ji 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 and he to, and he told the one thing this is the solution for all the problems ji ji is the one one just they take the vaccine na, for one one thing the Jee. same way this is also the one point for all the solutions Jee. all the problem ji i am master of uh, like my yeah. mind become the king king become the king i am king yeah 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 become the king thank you brother thank you i got the point for my presentation also <laughs> thank you so that's the beauty of babas murli na the thing that we are searching we get answers in that murli <laughs> that they tell yeah yeah ji yeah. sister om shanti i was also thinking of the same thing because some three days back i had asked you people as to uh, how to do <clears throat> seva like how to uh, spread the news that baba is arriving right the same day when i at 7 o'clock when i heard the murli the same the question the answer to my question was there <laughs> i was so surprised om shanti today, today also baba told na we need to fix the time to do the yeah. seva through the mind Yeah, yeah. Who have not fixed the time today? Fix your time. Only not listen the Murli. You do what he Baba wants, then you will enjoy the Murli. Then it will become your power. Anybody else? One more thing which I liked while you were narrating the Murli, conducting the Murli was when. the example of flower, rose flower and the lotus flower that you gave yeah. that's another remembrance that one can keep in front of us to be how how to be tension free the lotus yeah. flower speaks gives us an example of being detached yes and uh, the flower of rose gives us the space of how the fragrance can travel you just have to be it just yes. be it and people will get attracted for what bab dada has given that example when the people see the tension free on our faces yeah they will experience this thing. very good so the fragrance will spread you don't have yes, to sir. do any efforts yeah 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 that means tension free face very good someone anybody yeah and also baba told that manjite jagajit for that baba said that experience the help of blessings of father then it will yeah. become very easy Thank because you. blessings is is such a thing where we don't need to do any effort to achieve that's called the blessing but today bab dada is given the blessings to become tension free anybody lata ben or sukram bhai 
I don't know the names, so that's why I'm not calling the names. So, feel yourself and come forward. Om Shanti, brother. Uh, Om Shanti, uh, today, uh, actually, I liked what uh, Baba told about uh, being uh, tension free. Uh, and uh, um, uh, since today, my, my father in law is, uh, is uh, uh, getting operated, actually, I was. Uh, in the same thought from uh, from morning that everything should go well but uh, after listening to uh, to the murli today i thought baba is talking to me only uh, yes. be tension free and uh, uh, don't keep any burden on your head uh, uh, just to have the attention of remembering Baba. So that is what I was just uh, uh, recollecting in my mind. Actually, yes. I think ready and to you will, Then you will become an example to others. Yes, yes, that that's what I there. was. Yes, so I now I'm I'm keeping my my mind uh, focused only on Baba and not having any thought about uh, uh, any anything else. Uh, just uh, remembering Baba in in my in my thought uh, that uh, uh, he will be the surgeon and he will uh, get everything uh, uh, done. done. So I need not have any tension on my uh, my head like that. I was keeping on uh, thinking, brother. Thank yes, you. and and feel that I am Shiv Shakti. Yeah. I am Shiv. I am Shakti, mm -hmm. and Shiv Baba is with me. He is companion all the time. Yes, yes, yeah, keeping I'm him sure don't, don't forget this. Yes, yes, brother. Okay. Thank you. Om Shanti. Om Shanti. Uh, I'd like to add one point to Rakhi's sister, what she said about Rose and be that. Actually, when I was, actually one day I was, you know, uh, churning on this. Uh, what does Rose do actually? Whenever uh, somebody tries to touch it, you know, uh, forcefully, his petals, you know, its petals uh, uh, separate it from the bud. But his, you know, charitra and chitra, it, it always remains the same. He is, you know, continue giving the fragrance to the person, even who is trying to touch it you know, forcefully and his its petals are separated and and remains the, uh, you know, flower only. The, you know, uh, petals are same and the color is same and, you know, Bapsi, Charitra and Chitra remains yeah. the same. Yeah. I was running one day. Yeah. Everybody remember the homework, what we need to do today? We need to give the happiness to others, to our brothers and sisters. We need to spread the rays of happiness. Fix some time in the day. Throughout the day, fix some time. If you're not fixed, fix the time to do the service through mind to give the happiness to everyone. Okay? Or anybody want to share the points? We all are in silence absorbing the points of the movie <laughs> today. <laughs> very, very good, very good. No problem. So, in the interest of time, rather we can move on to meditation. Yes, please. In the meditation, also, now we are going to do spreading the happiness to the world, to our brothers and sisters, and be a Shiv Shakti and spread these vibrations of happiness, happiness of race to each and every soul.
Shanti, thank you, Satish Bhai. Thank, thank you, all of you. Have if you all are having any time. doubts, also you can you can share to Rakhi when she can send. To. Thank you so much, Satish Bhai, for that. Let's have good homework. Let's be happy and make others happy. Yes. And we can and meet tomorrow the time. morning. Yes. We should meet it's tomorrow the time morning. time for Mansa Seva. Yes. Om Shanti. Thank you, Baiji. Om Shanti. Tomorrow morning at 5.30 a.m. Om Shanti. Thank you. Thank you, brother. Om Shanti. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome all. Welcome all. Om Shanti.